Thank you. To, uh, today, I, uh, this evening, I'll be talking to you about the web hosting options. And as we are starting, I want you to pay attention is so that because for the first time you may not get it, but as time goes on, you will understand. Then I will repeat again. That's why I'm having double classes. For bloggers, domain.com will offer you a variety of hosting options. Now, what are those hosting options? Each one will give you unique benefits and capabilities. You know, we need we have hosting sites, and we have mentioned nine that are good. Linux, uh, when we now look at it, there are different options that they offer. One is Linux hosting. You don't need to actually disturb yourself about this. I only put it there for your knowledge. Le no, you all know about Windows. You have all heard about Windows before. Windows is an operating system. The same thing with Linux. It's an operating system. Just know that. Don't know more than that. Don't disturb yourself at all. Uh, the only person I've gone through everybody here, the only person that will understand this is uh, Dr. Adepoju, and it's because she's in computing. So you don't need to disturb yourself, but Linux hosting is an option uh, for bloggers, but that is not what we, you are uh, dealing with. Apart from Linux hosting, what's the next one? We have shared hosting, shared hosting. Shared hosting is a type of web hosting where a single physical server hosts multiple sites. This one will make the site to be slow. And you see, you have to be careful. Uh, this is one of the areas where no matter how much you learn, you still need professionals in handling your blogs. Some people can deceive you and they will go and give you a shared host. Share hosting is like, I have a house and you, are, you rent a room in my house. Don't forget that there is no way you will describe your room without making reference to my house because I am the landlord of the house. That's shared hosting. So when there is uh, traffic, it's usually, uh, the, it, will be low, it will be slow. Do you understand? And it's not advisable. If you are not aware, if you don't have a faithful person handling your blog, they can go and give you shared hosting. These are the problems we have with some of these younger boys. They will give you shared hosting. They will tell you it's cheaper. Yes. And that's why I put it there. You also, when you hear their price, there is one of my boys. Uh, I say one of my boys because of the kind of respect. Because of the kind of respect he gives, you understand. So, and he he, he went on the site and he was saying, he, he gave a price for website. And I was wondering, is he going to add his money for the client? I now wondered, I got to let out, find out that what is probably using. Ah, Dr. Shonubi, you are welcome, sir. Our network has been fine here. Uh, well, network issue. At times, I always advise people that I always advise people that you should try your best, maybe to find a place, maybe to find a place separate from where you are, so that you can have the network at your at your disposal. You are uh, at you at your comfort. At times, a, a simple change can help you. A simple change can help you. Thank you so much. Now, um, please, you can, you, at times, if you move from the sitting room to the, to the living room, there can be a change. That's, these are the things we experience. We, at our end here, yeah, we have about, uh, but that's because we are doing business anyway. We have different network providers. So in the course of this class, I've changed twice from Airtel to Glow and, you know, all those things. Those are the challenges we face in our country. Uh, we will get over it by God's grace. Now, back to what we are uh, talking of, you see that this is shared, and the shared one, you may not understand. Network is kind of plenty care. Thanks. Okay? Okay? Uh, please uh, um, admit, check on Dr. Shonubi, please. 
Thank you. So now, by the time you look at it, you discover that that shared hosting will be slow, but you will not know. You won't know. And you will not be able to manage it yourself. It's that person that will manage. Let me tell you how shared hosting works. Shared hosting, if you are five and you want a, a blog from a particular person, you can buy a, the same, it will buy a particular uh, blog and create site for each of you within that name. Do you understand what I'm saying? So you could buy five. It's like someone renting a five bedroom flat and it's now, you know, you're all going to have the same sitting room. That's how it goes in shadow state. But you cannot know because you are not a professional in that field. That is why you must be very careful uh, about uh, issue of uh, blogging website design. These are the technical aspects with which some of these boys do some uh, funny, funny background and uh, underground works, which you have to be careful of. The best form of hosting is the VPS, which is virtual private server. Virtual private server. I want you to write that down. VPS, virtual private server. Write it down. That's the best. It's a step above shared hosting plans. When you buy that, the uh, virtual private server hosting plan, you're essentially securing a mini server within the larger server. It's in your name. You are in control. Like what we have for Sophia Adeyeye is a VPS, virtual private server. You have to be very careful about that. You understand? So it is, it, that's what we have. Then if you, by the time, if a share server is busy, if a share server is busy, you see that the virtual private server will not be busy, it will be working. Virtual private server, thank you, by Larry. Virtual private server, virtual private server, thanks so much. Uh, you see that it's going to be, uh, so. <laughs> thank you so much, Sophia, God bless you. Virtual private server, Mr. Samuel Oyebuade, I thank you and respect you for that. So now you have all this, uh, with you, bloggers with a VPS plan enjoy enhanced privacy, have greater control over their virtual space. It's yours. It's yours. Virtual private server, uh, Pastor Joshua. I I appreciate that. You understand? So have greater control over their virtual space uh, and aren't as affected by issues of traffic. The portion of the server you pay for is only dedicated to you and your blog, and that's the best. That's the best you can have. That's why I was telling you that all those things you see uh, about prices on some of those sites, they are, they are, they are, uh, it's better to just uh, ignore some of them. Now that's that. Having said that, there is something else going forward. Is the web hosting for blog. Web hosting options for blog. Now the web hosting option for blog, uh, Okay, I've done the first two. The third one, the third option, is something that we need to consider together and very, very seriously. I hope you can see this. And that is where we are, what we are dealing on in this class. The options for hosting blog is WordPress hosting. WordPress hosting. Today's class, you must understand what WordPress is. WordPress hosting. Now, when you talk about WordPress hosting, excuse me, if you're interested in blogging and you, you don't anticipate building out a full website, WordPress hosting is the ideal platform. It is tailor made for bloggers and comes loaded with built-in features that allow you to easily customize your page. Uh, the, the, okay. What we will we'll learn about, we are still learning about home page today anyway. So it will help you to customize your page. So if you do choose a WordPress hosting plan, you will be restricted from setting up a non-WordPress site. I'm going to be explaining WordPress. Yeah, thank you, Dr. Shonubi. WordPress hosting. Wow, uh, Dr. Taiwo. But you are making this class lively. <clears throat> if you turn me on, I can teach in level, no? but no, I won't do that. I won't do that. Let me, let me, you, you are all doing well, eh? 
you all doing well, all right? So it's nice. Well, Sophia, I've not seen you right, oh, because you will, uh -huh. Victor Ladeji, God bless you. That's good. Now, what press hosting? If you do choose a WordPress hosting plan, WordPress is important. That's what you are going to be learning, and you are going to become masters of it in, in this class. Um, I'm, I'm excited. So WordPress is very, very important. You will be restricted from setting up a non-WordPress site. However, the capabilities embedded within the WordPress platform are comprehensive, and what do they do? They can satisfy the needs of all bloggers. From, they can satisfy the need of all bloggers for, from beginners to veterans. So uh, WordPress is what uh, most of us use, right from the beginners to veterans. So no matter what the class is, WordPress hosting will be of help to you. So now you will discover that WordPress hosting is something that, uh, thank you so much, Dr. Uh, now, it, it, it will help you. It has everything you need, and you will be able to get the best from it. The package offers unlimited disk space and bandwidth. Free domain registration. This free domain registration is not true. It has, uh, let me quickly delete it. But that's what they will tell you is given. But they will have embedded the money somewhere else. Unlimited email accounts, free search engine marketing cred uh, credit. And most importantly, 24 7 support. You enjoy this if there is a problem. So you have all this attached to your blog, WordPress hosting. So you have to understand if you don't understand WordPress, then there is nothing we are doing here that uh, you must understand WordPress. And that's the purpose of this class. Uh, at the moment, we are done with that. We just look at our front page again, then we can take, we can call it a class. Now, what's WordPress all about? Let's look at it. Let's look at it. WordPress, we are starting talking about WordPress. Now, if you look at this, uh, we want to see what WordPress is all about. And it's very important that you pay attention to that. Now, WordPress. Okay, WordPress hosting plan is important. Comprehensive and significant to veteran. Oh, wonderful. Fatima Pacha, I'm excited reading this from you. Ah, that's wonderful. Ah, wow. That's wonderful. You people, you are tempting me. Oh, <laughs> you know, I'm saying it now. I will just keep on teaching. WordPress is a content management system that originated as a blogging tool. It runs on PHP and MySQL database. This one, you don't need it. It's meant for professionals, but it's good. You are reading it. That's, it runs on PHP and a MySQL database. These are the basis on which WordPress runs. WordPress, we call it CMS, Content Management System. You remember the issue of content management, which is part of, you know the title of this course is Blog Design and Content management. Now, you see, the, the, the WordPress is built such that it's a content management system itself. So it will help you to manage your system adequately. That's the WordPress. And you have to understand that very, very seriously. So you discover that the design elements are packaged as themes. We are going to be looking at that. You remember we spoke about themes the other time. Since content and design are separate, one need only install a new team to get a whole new design without affecting the content. Now, everybody in the class, can you listen to me? I'm coming back to inform you or remind you of the fact that there are two things in blog design. The two things in blog design are what and what. Who can tell me? There are two things. There are just two things in blog design. I want you to type it. If you are right, I'll tell you. If you are wrong, I'll tell you. Yes, I think I should be grading you in this class. The first to write, you score more because that person will have written without any influence. The two important aspects of where blog design is what and what. Omaladi, I'm not hearing from you. Omaladi, I'm not hearing from you. And I want to read from you. Waiting to read from you.
No answer yet. Okay, there's an answer. <laughs> Sophia, wrong. Blood design and content management. Thank you so much. I trust you. But, uh, that's it. Barrister Larry, right. Uh, my HOD, right. Page design and content management. I just said design and content management. Design and content management. Yes. Uh, Dr. Aboyade, wrong. It's not WordPress. Oh, yeah, others begin to answer. Everybody must answer. If I told you you are wrong, write another thing. You must answer until you are right. Design and content management. Thank you. The two most important things are page design and content management. Thank you so much, Dr. Shonobi. Thank you. That means that you are getting the network back. And imagine, I'm here to hear from you. Uh, by Pastor Joshua, you are not doing well. I wish I that you come again. I said the two most important things in blog design, in blog, in blog development. What are the two most important things? Fatima, thank you. Page design and content management. Content and page design. So uh, to write content management is a problem. You must shorten it again. OK. You are not doing well. For sure, you are not in class. So Luanimi, I'm not hearing from you. I don't know. Is it the elderly ones are even faster on the system than the younger ones? I don't understand this uh, thing, you know. Content management and page design. Very good. Thank you so much, Etola. Pastor Ayori Day, Ajay Yomi, I'm not hearing from you. Push your page design and content management. Thank you so much. Yes. So those are the two important things. Now, another question for you. What is another name for page design? Yes, Dr. Taiwa, I saw it. You are one of the, uh, what's it? Tolu uh, Animi Moyolua. I don't know. You raised your hand, no problem. Page layout, no. There are another name for page design. Pastor Joshua, no. Is on the slide though. Chebi, is the slide covered? Is, is it covered with that chat? Uh, okay. Oh, Sophia, I'm dancing. Good of you. That's the answer. Sophia got it right. The answer is thin. The answer is thin. Thank you. The answer is thin. Now, those things, please keep them with you. They are very important. Now, you have, now, okay. So, when you, you see with what we have, we know that the two important things are now the design, the page design, which is also called theme, and what? And the content. Look at this. Page design, which is also called theme, and the content. So WordPress is a content management software, and you can use it to build and maintain a website without even having knowledge of coding. So you don't need to understand any form of programming. Relax yourself. You don't need to understand programming. This software will enable you to customize every aspect of your site. The first version started in 2003. You don't really need that. Let's move on because of our time. WordPress.org. Now, there, are, there is something you need to understand. There is difference between WordPress.org and WordPress.com. A lot of you will, should not mix this up. There is a lot of difference. WordPress.org is self-hosted WordPress. And this is why you have to be careful. I don't know. Some of these... Uh, some of these things I'm teaching you tonight, if you know their importance, eh, I'm revealing some. Ah, uh, Dr. Aboyade, I'm sorry, ma, how do we handle your network? Maybe if network is bad, at times if you leave the sitting room, as I said, and you go to the bedroom or you move outside the house, most of the time you can pick network because if the network is getting bad now and it was not bad before, it could just be 
some weather things. You know, those are the things we can do. At times, we advise that people should log out and log in again. You could, if you log out and log in, you can get a better um, uh, network. Now, I was talking about WordPress.org and WordPress.com. WordPress.org is different. That is the original, sorry, the two are original, but that is the best platform you should use. When they sell, it's the free open source WordPress software that you can install on your own web host to create a website that's 100% your own. Can you see that? 100% your own, WordPress.org. Whereas WordPress.com is, is for a profit, paid service that is powered by the WordPress.org software. You know one funny thing? WordPress.com will be on the WordPress.org software. If you are working on WordPress.org, it will bring WordPress.com and advise you to go for it. If you go for it, it's simple to use, but you will lose much of the flexibility of the self-hosted WordPress. So for your blog, just stay with WordPress.org. So when you are saying, I know WordPress, I know WordPress, is it .org, is it .com? There are two different things. Most of the time when people say WordPress, what they are referring to is the WordPress.org, which is the self-hosted one. If you want to truly own your website, self-hosted WordPress.org is almost the best option. Actually, that's what you should go for. Do you understand? Because if you go, if you use the other one, it's going to affect you one way or the other. So that is that. Please, I believe if I ask you in a question, which one is better? You know which one is better. I'm still going to ask you. So WordPress.org is open source software. It's managed by a non-profit WordPress Foundation. WordPress.org is managed by WordPress Foundation. That's the best thing that you can use in managing your um, in managing your blog. And it is usually available with all web hosts. The host Blue uh, the Blue Host has WordPress.org. You understand? So uh, WordPress.com is a for-profit business owned by automatic that owned by automatic that uses WordPress.org open software. You see, anytime you install WordPress.org, WordPress.com is also there. It will be coming as an option. Once you choose it and you leave WordPress.org, you'll be limited by what you can do you'll be limited. The two are officially separate entities, though the unofficial lines can, be, can get blood because the uh, founders, Matt Mulliweng, is, is both the founder of the WordPress Foundation and the founder of Automatic. The Automatic is, uh, is, uh, is just a name, not a hair. So as a result, the two entities remain closely linked. But their link is not your own issue. Your issue is that anytime you are working and you see WordPress.com, don't install. Just ignore. Ignore it and follow the WordPress.org. Now, how do you, not only does WordPress power the you know, business, it's also most popular way to create e-commerce. What's the power of WordPress? You can use it for business websites, e-commerce stores, for blogs, portfolios, resumes, forums. We are going to start using this WordPress tomorrow. Everybody in this house, tomorrow, we will start using WordPress. Now, so WordPress, now, even if you, are, if you are not a developer like me, you can easily modify your website to, due to WordPress which ecosystem of teams and plugins. Now, very good. Two things, the two ecosystem, two ecosystem, in WordPress, the two major ecosystems in WordPress is what and what. Please quickly type it. Quickly type it. It's what and what. I want to read it all. I want to read it all. Uh -huh. What and what? Teams and plugins, good. 
everybody must type one, two teams and plugins. Yes, Otitola. It's teams. Reverend Nathaniel, teams. It has S. Teams and plugin. Plugins. Teams and plugins. Yes. Check it. Check it on the screen. Teams and plugins. Fatima, the G is just one. Yes, for sure, good of you. Dr. Taiwo, very good of you, ma'am. Teams and plugins. You got it right. You are in class now. Yes, thank you, Fatima. Thank you for that correction. Have I, um, Antipalake? I'm not seeing your work. Oh. Yes, Dr. Shonubi, you are doing well. Oh. Teams and plugins. I've not seen Antifalaka's work. Okay, thank you so much. I've seen your work, man. Now, you see, from what we have here, what are teams? Teams. Ah, thank you, Pastor Ayo. Teams and plugins. Those are the two important things. Very important. Teams and plugins. Now you begin to ask yourself, what are teams? Teams and plugins. Yes, yes. Thank you so much, Dr. Aboyade. Toluanimi Moi, thank you so much. Teams and plugins. Now, this is what I have to tell, I have to explain to you. Teams is for, teams is for what? Anybody can answer that. Just anybody, the fastest to answer. Teams is for what? What does teams represent? Anybody should answer that? Not everybody, hey, who is giving me an answer? Ah, outlook. And yes, I want the proper word. Teams is for what? It's for Outlook, but I want the proper technical language. You are now professionals. Aesthetics, eh, I want the technical language. We have used it here. Thank you, Sophia. Thank you, Dr. Ogunjobi. Teams is for design. Teams is for design. Teams is for design. You have to take note of this, so because from tomorrow, I will not be coming back to this. I won't be coming back home. Teams is for design. Now, these uh, teams, this primarily change how your website looks. That's the design. If your website, thank you so much. It's not everybody, just, I just want all of you, background look for design. Thank you so much, uh, Dr. Aboyade. So you look at it. Teams is primarily for design, how your website looks. Now, plugin, this primarily change how your website functions. Someone is talking to me. How your website looks, how you see it, what is in charge, things. But how it works, how it works as you post it, you get statistics about it. What is in charge of that? Can you tell me? Plugins can be something small, like a contact form. You, you, you see, if you want to call, ah, oh, Dr. Babala, I'm not seeing you here. What Dr. Babala's uh, website needs is just the plugins. That's all our website needs. Just the plugins. Just the plugins. Just the plugins. So your contact form, you will do it by plugin. When you create an e-commerce store, you do it by plugin. So currently there are over 50,000 free WordPress plugins and 5,000 free website, uh, WordPress teams, as well as tons of premium options. That is to say you have plenty of choices and you can pick from different ones. You see, you just, uh, tomorrow, when we'll be in class, we'll, be, we'll look at it. You need to understand these things. They are the design. Just choose it. It has been designed for you already. You just choose it. 
plugins is what will determine how your website will function. You just choose it. Like, uh, if you want to be collecting, you know, if you go to www.dioshobwale, let's quickly go to www.dioshobwale.com. Uh, I think we quickly need to go there. www.dioshobwale.com. Let me see. I will be showing you some things. Uh, if you open that, www.dioshobwale.com. Uh, okay, so let me say home page. Now, okay, I have a message. Who is that? Teams is for design, plugin is for functions. As little as good, as little as contact form, or do. Thank you so much, Fatima. Oh, Fatima, this is wonderful. Fatima, you are a good writer, and I think I appreciate that. So let's quickly go to. I don't know where this one is coming from now. The people using this laptop. Now, if you get to, I want to show you some of the plugins in, in, in that with dioshowali.com. I'm trying to load it. Okay. Are you seeing the screen? Thank you. It's still loading. Okay, it has loaded. Now, if you look at this, themes, can you see how this thing, how this thing looks? Now, do you know why this picture is here? It's because of the theme I chose. If I choose another theme, it will change the entire look, but the content will remain the same. If I choose another theme, you all can just open, every one of you should open there. Open at that site now. Open at the site. Now, if you look at this theme, the theme I chose gave this look. You know, this is the header from our previous class. You know, this is the header. So this header is here because of the team I chose. Now, if you want to check the plugin, are you there? Have you opened that site? Have you all opened the site? If you want to check the team, sorry, the plugins, now look at this place, email address. I want you to see it. Okay, thank you so much, ma. Thank you so much. Now, if you look at this place, you if it says type in your email address, that is a plug-in. That is a plug-in. Though, if you have not subscribed, I will advise you to subscribe so that we can become digital friends. You understand? This is a plug-in. If your blog does not have this plug-in, then you are not doing well, though. You must have that plugin. That is very important. Now, this site, where you have this plugin, what is it called? What is this site called? I taught you last, uh, I taught you in the last class. What is this site called? Who can recollect? I gave this site the name, this part. Just recollect and tell me. We have 13 minutes to go. We'll be running up by 9.30. What is this site called? Anybody? Anybody? What is this site called? This site, this site that, that I'm showing you. This site. I gave it a name. Barista Lalere, Dr. Tawo Gunjobi. 
You are in class. Yes, someone has answered. Let me see what's the answer. Widget. Sophia, don't ask questions. That's the answer. Everybody just clap for Sophia. He's not navigator, he's just it. Sophia, I'm clapping for you. Can you hear me? I'm just clapping. You are just very wonderful. This is the sidebar. Yeah, widget. It's called widget. It's called widget. This side is called widget. I told you. I don't want you to forget. That's why I kept on asking in class. So this blog starts is showing everything is talking about widgets. Do you understand? So now what I want you to understand now is this. If you look at this side, these categories, all these things are plugins. Plugins. It does how it functions. Do you understand? That is how it functions. Now I expect, let me let me say this. If you have not subscribed, type in your email address there and click on subscribe. It completes that form. That is it. Now, that is one. If you go down, can you see this? Can you all see this? Uh, which, what is this? Which one am I pointing to now? Oh, it's going. I don't want to go there yet. Which one am I pointing to? Who can answer me? I'm pointing to something here. What am I okay? Someone is answering. Who is that? Twitter. Twitter. Thank you so much. Now that Twitter is not uh, that Twitter is not from team, it's from plugin. So when you have Twitter, can you imagine it will now take you to my tweet uh, Twitter handle? It will take you to my Twitter handle. Can you see it? Oh, atv.showvalley.com via a doctor that showvalley. Are you getting it now? That is what we are talking about. So the next one is Facebook. All these things are plugins. These are the things. You'll be learning how to do them tomorrow. They are plugins. Now, someone came and comment. This comment, this comment you see here is part of the plugin. So it may not be there if you don't put it there. This comment. Now, let me show you something that happens in comments. Dr. Adepoju, can you please leave a comment here and just leave a comment? Let's see what will happen. Just a short comment. Just a short comment. Quickly, please. We have just 10 more minutes to go. Quickly, Dr. Adepoju, while you are doing that, you see that this recent post, the, all these things, you see it, the design and the plugins, they work together to give you a blog. You have asked about the issue of the page design and the issue of the content. Now you are hearing again about the plugins. Now you see this is the content. That is what I have written about. You can see now that uh, as we are here, let me let me reload and see something. Five thousand three sixty. Um, Barista Olalere, please come to this place and subscribe. I want to show you something. You know we have 305 now. Barista Olalere, just put your email there and you click on subscribe. Dr. Ogunjobi, if you have not subscribed, please do. Is if Sophia has subscribed? Sophia, if you have not subscribed, do, but I know Sophia has subscribed. I just want to show you something again. Now, um, Dr. Adepoju, have you made the comments? Make it very brief, ma. Make it very brief. We have nine minutes to go. Dr. Gunjabi, have you subscribed? Please, yes, I quickly need those answers. I need the answers. Okay, someone, is, someone has answered me here. Okay, you just did. Very good. You just did. Uh, who else? Um, thank you so much. Please watch. You know this is Studio 5. Uh, Barista Olalere, have you subscribed? Pastor Ayo, you can also subscribe. It will, be, it will be a welcome idea. I want to show you. This is Studio 5 subscribers. Subscribe. 
uh, Dr. Adepoju, have you made a comment? Okay, Sophia. Sophia, you've done it before. Yes, I have subscribed just now. Okay, you just did it. Very good. I think that has helped. Um, Dr. Adepoju, now let's do something. On your page, on my page here too, try and refresh. Try and reload. Reload on your page. I have also reloaded. The load on your page is not giving me what I want. Now, what I'm supposed to have, I think I'm, I am having network issue. When you reload like that, there is an automatic increase in the number. Okay, I think I'm having network issue. I'm having a network issue here. Uh, the speed with which is responding. There is going to be an automatic increase in the subscribers, when, especially when you are subscribing for the first time. Do you understand? Uh, of course, you can only subscribe once. It will, it will give you an increase. Take note, we are 305. When we'll be meeting tomorrow, you will take note of the number you will have. Now, everything you are seeing here has shown you very clearly that uh, it has shown you very clearly that you have the content. And that content is what I've always asked you to write. And of course, you have written it. Now, if you look at the content, now let's look at this together. Dr. Shobo Ale is not only a gifted, but also a licensed and passionate speaker. He's an academic by excellence with a doctorate degree in computer science. He's a registered engineer and also a lawyer. What a rare combination. He is equally an experienced businessman, being the founder and chairman of Davos College of Management and Technology, a vocational and academic institution located in Oshu State, Nigeria. Dr. Shubale, being an educational psychologist, you are therefore assured of a balanced, comprehensive, and holistic approach to any topic given to him. It has, if he has been invited to speak and deliver papers at various conferences, seminars, churches, on various topics, both within and outside the country. Now, can you see this? Now, this you have seen now, you must have a write-up like this about yourself. I'm going back to the content. That is what must be uh, in front. Please, you have to do a write-up like this about yourself. You keep it, I will need it tomorrow. I'll be in need of it in class tomorrow, please. We are going to need it in class tomorrow, please. We will need it in class. Now, if you look at this, uh, you see that what I am uh, serving here, what I'm selling here, is that your Shobo Ali initiative. Now, um, Auntie Falake, this is the question you ask. This page is a web page. If you want to get my blog, you will come here to get to the blog. But before then, you see this is Dayo Shobo Ale initiative. Can you see how to design logo? This is my logo, DSI. Some of you, you see it, this is the logo, DSI. Dayo Shobo Ale initiative. That's the logo. We all know what logo looks like. But what most of you design, you are using your picture. Your picture does not form local. No, it doesn't. It doesn't. It doesn't. This is an example of a logo. So when you design something like this, you have a concept. Pettyly did very well with logo. I so much appreciate what you have done. So when I said you should design logo, this is what I was asking you to design. Do you understand what I'm saying now? Then the assignment I will give you today is that you should give me a header. Sophia. Give me a header. Now, this is a header. I have placed this logo on this header. This is the header. The header starts from here down to this side. This is my picture on the header. The header is the head. So everything you get to, you will always, because I want my logo to always be there, that is why I placed it on my header. Do you understand? Now, you see, this is my own page. So, Auntie Polake, what I have done is to combine both my own page and my blog site. Now, if you want to know where my blog is, oh, 
very easy. When you come to navigation and you click on blog, when you come to navigation and you click on blog, you get my blog and this is my blog. This is the last thing. That's why we told you that a blog, you see, that's where we are coming from, home. That's my home page, is my web page. In my own site, I have combined both website and blog site. I combined the two of them together. That's what I did. You understand? Oh, I have two more minutes to go. So now if you come to blog, if you click on blog, you will see that it will show you all the blogs I have written. All the blogs I have written. And you can begin to see them. You see, this is the last one I wrote. This is the last one I wrote. You can see that that header is still there. The header is permanent, is there. So you see it, that's my title, New Normal, Digital Transformation for Health, Law and Business. That's the last thing I wrote. You can see now, this is adding graphics. You can see this is different. Now, the moment I am done, thanks, Dr. Dashobali and all those stuff, you see, this is another one. You see, that is how a blog, all your writings, the new number one, you see it now, all your writings will be arranged in reverse chronological order. That is what you are seeing here. In reverse chronological order, that is how your writings will be arranged. I'll be explaining some of these things to you for that tomorrow. So that is how uh, the site goes. Do you understand? So with this that we have had, I believe that you have been able to learn one or two things. We will keep on. We will keep on. Tomorrow we are going to have a single class because of uh, the, I don't want to bore you. And tomorrow, after tomorrow, what we are going to be doing tomorrow, let's quickly, let's quickly go back to what we have here. If you come here, you discover that the next thing here is WordPress installation. WordPress team installation. This is what we'll be dealing with tomorrow. We want to see how do you install WordPress? Then how do you manage WordPress? I'll be teaching you about that. And tomorrow I might be taking two or two hours to three hours from us. So I'm looking at, uh, should we meet by two again? Two will be 12, um, okay? Should we meet by two or we should meet by three o'clock? Three to five or three to six tomorrow. What time should it be?